companies are not looking forward to going back to the traditional way of signing a 20-year lease and setting up these non-flexible headquarters. That's dead. The office is very different today. You know, the biggest or most of our larger customers are the world's most valuable companies who basically are sending us their employees because they don't know, you know, how many days they're going to be working because they don't know where their business is going to grow. And when you're sitting in the only company in the world that has over a thousand buildings in pretty much most important cities around the world, the demand for WeWork space today is higher than it was prior to the pandemic. So what the pandemic allowed, we work allowed to re-embed itself. It allowed to learn how to operate on a most uh, cost-flexible basis. And now you have a WeWork that, like I said before, you know, WeWork should be a profitable company by the end of this year or by the beginning of next year is latest. And demand for this type of flexible of space is higher than ever. And I think the world is going to redefine in terms of where flexibility becomes the most important part that a company can offer its employees. I got to go there with the crypto question. Obviously, we worked last month announced that it would be accepting payment in the form of cryptocurrencies, known to be Bitcoin. It also said it would hold some on its balance sheet. Today, we saw Elon Musk come out and say Tesla would no longer be taking Bitcoin over concerns about the impact it has on the environment. Obviously, the environmental impact of mining Bitcoin has, has gone up significantly over the past few months. Is that the right move? Is that something we're likely to see WeWork follow or is that just a sort of a reaction to, uh, to a short term trend? No, I mean, the reason why we decided to accept cryptocurrencies was because our customers were asking for it. We you know one of the things that we do with Sandeep is we listen to our customers a lot. And we have to write, they tell us the type of office they're looking, they tell us the type of setups that they want. And and the, the crypto word came out a lot where employees say, you know, we would like to pay you in crypto. We have accumulated a significant amount of wealth in, in crypto that we would like to use it to pay for rent, as rent becomes an important part of many companies. So we decided to basically accept crypto. And at the same time, you know, as people pay us in crypto. It to us, it's just another currency. It's like we're holding to, we have US dollars, we got euros, we got pounds, we got crypto, we got Japanese yens, we got uh, so. To us, it makes no difference. And when our customers ask for reimbursement in crypto, we pay in crypto. And we have, you know, we've had some of our customers who are paying us in cryptocurrencies. And we have some landlords who said, look, I would like you to pay me in cryptocurrencies. So, you know, uh, the way we work looks at it is, you know, we are, we're going to listen to what our customers want from us. And if they demand it, that they wanted to pay in crypto, that's why we took crypto as a form of payment. Do you have a level that you'd be comfortable going to in terms of your sort of total uh, money going in and out in the form of crypto? I mean, today's a very small part of our business. I think it's the beginning. I think crypto is a mega trend. I think crypto cannot be ignored. And, uh, you know, it's going to grow according to whatever our customers want. If our customers want to pay in crypto more, you know, we're going to accept crypto. If our customers want to pay on traditional currency, we're going to accept form of payment as, as traditional currency. So to us, this was nothing more than a move to basically help our customers satisfy some of their needs that our customers were asking from. Or obviously, our first customer and the large one was Coinbase. Not a lot of people know, but you know, the headquarters of most of the real estate that Coinbase uses is WeWork, and and being them the largest exchange of cryptocurrency, they you know they they they, had, they were the first customer to pay us in cryptocurrency.